Hello, it's Uncle Jim. It's been a long day. Got a live chat in about an hour and I still haven't taken a shower. Anyway, I wanted to share this with you because it's kind of neat. So these are uh, rifle rack inserts you can put in your safes or whatever. So in a previous video, my son got a school locker and was going to convert it into a... Uh, a gun locker for extra space in his room and then I painted it and it fell over in a windstorm and kind of trashed it a little bit so uh, he got his own you've seen that video and that was nice what he got and so I got the ten dollar school locker it's got a, a few dents in it <laughs> but I figured I could put that in the walk-in closet to save space all right and we both needed some space. So um, it didn't have any gun racks in it. So I asked him to 3D print me some gun racks. And this is a 15 by 15 inch type deal. And he was going to do that. But then he decided just to buy these for uh, my gun locker thing. Uh, school locker, locker, whatever. So let me show you this. Uh, some people might need this or extra ones. This is pretty cool. It was $10 for two of these. All right. They come with some, a uh, little bit of hardware there. If you want to go into, if you want to go into walls or whatever. Okay, so. Uh, it comes well packed. They're beveled like this, which is nice. But the great thing about it is they got magnets. Okay? And that is really cool. It's going to save me a lot of time figuring out the height I want for different rifles and all that stuff. Now, uh, the magnets look really good. And uh, the great thing about this is... Uh, they're kind of glued on, but you can kind of peel them back and cut it the length you want. If you want to delete one of these, whatever, I'm going to have to because they're 16 inches long. And I only need 15, but I figured I can do a back wall and then uh, do a, maybe one or two on the sides. Maybe I do a, a 45 cut. I don't know. But you can do whatever you want with these. And it's just like a hard foam, and it won't uh, hurt your blued guns or anything. And what's nice is you got your shallow and your guns uh, that have scopes on them. And so I, I thought I'd share that with you real quick uh, before the shower in the chat. So for 10 bucks versus 3D printed, I, I get it. Uh, with the magnets, it's much easier we were going to use uh, like the uh, 3M tape just to hold them in there. But these have magnets and they're very strong. So you can cut them to fit. As a matter of fact, let me take you over here real quick. Gosh, I got that box out of my butt. Okay. Anyway, this is all improvised. And my cabinet's a little dirty. Okay. This is a heavy-duty file cabinet, right? Let me grab one of these. Bam! So, you know, me, I'm the monkey. I, would, I wouldn't figure out where I want them yet or anything. Well, here, let me bring this down. You don't have to worry about it. You can just stick it where you want and then put some on the sides. I, I like how it's beveled. I like if tay. So anyway, watch this. Let me unlock the file cabinet. This is a heavy-duty file cabinet. And it's got stuff in it. Now watch. Okay. The magnet is that strong. I really got to pull on it to get it to come loose. So that's all you need. All right. So if you need extra space in your safe, you don't want a 3D print, I don't know what the company name is. If you're super interested, uh, I'll reply back with where he got them or what they were. But it was 10 bucks for two, 16 inches each. 
and I really like how these are shaped and how it's beveled on one side. Let me pull that off. You can have it the other way if you want. I think that was a great idea. That was some good engineering there. So, and the magnets, like I said, these magnets are on there. So you don't have to worry about that. And you don't have to worry about mismeasuring because you can always change it. So uh, mine is 15 inches by 15 inches. So I'm gonna have to cut this. I could lop off one corner here. I can 45 it and have one come out the side on each side. We'll figure that out later, but there you go. So, that is pretty cool. Let me bring you back over here and try and focus. And for some reason, they like to stand up. And my desk isn't magnetic, so whatever. All right. So there you go. If you need something like that and you don't want a 3D print, there you go. Until next time, thanks for watching America. I'm not editing, so no flag. Until next time.